Hello, in this mobile how-to video we're going to be looking at the settings for the phone on the LG G3. So let's go ahead, launch up the phone application, then go to the top right hand corner and tap call settings. Now we've got a, an array of options that pop up, we've got all of our voicemail settings at the top so I can choose the service, obviously I've only got one which is my carrier. I can allow it to vibrate, so I'm going to put always. I can change the notification sound, so when I get a voicemail, this is what I'll hear. I'm happy with that, so I'm going to go ahead and tap OK, because as you can see, it has selected it. So I tap OK. I'm happy with the voicemail settings. Fixed dial-in numbers, I'm going to leave all of those as they are. Incoming voice call pop-up, show incoming voice pop yeah, let me get that again. Show incoming voice call pop up when an app is in use. So essentially what that does is it pops up if you're receiving a phone call whilst you're in an application. I suggest you leave that on otherwise you might find yourself missing a call. Call reject, change call reject settings and manage reject calls from list. So I can go in and uh, turn off or turn on, so I can reject calls on list, or I can reject all calls if I wanted to, if I want, wasn't in a position to accept a phone call. I've got decline with message, so I can decline a phone call with a message. For example, if I'm in a meeting, I can decline with, in a meeting, call you right back. I can also go ahead, tap them, and edit them as well, so I could say, in a meeting, call, try again in half an hour, for example. Once you've edited it, tap save, I'm gonna ha gonna go ahead and leave those there. Privacy Keeper, show caller info ID. I'm happy to show caller info. Call forwarding, so if, uh, if I had another device, I can forward the phone calls onto that, and that's just making it a lot easier for me. If I had two phones, if it doesn't answer on one, it's gonna ring through to the other. Auto answer, again, I leave that turned off just because I might want to ignore a phone call. Connection vibration, vibration when other parties answer the call. I'm going to leave that off. Voice enhancement, enhance voice clarity in noisy environments so you can hear more clearly. That sounds like a beneficial feature. I'm going to go ahead and tick that. Not available when speaker is on. That message went. Save unknown numbers to a contact after a call. I'm going to go ahead and leave that off. Power key ends call. That's an option, let's turn that on. Call barring, so I, all of my call barring settings are in there. Locking, coming out, going, and international calls. Call duration, so I can check my call durations. And of course, I've got additional call settings, which I'm actually just gonna tap into and see what it brings up. Caller ID, use default operator settings to display your number in outgoing calls. There's more settings in there. And call waiting during a call, notify me of incoming calls. Gonna go ahead and tap that as well. So that's just been a quick look at these phone settings on the LG G3. You can go ahead, go into any of these in further detail, have a play around, and really customize your G3 to your own preferences. Thank you for watching.